Meghan Markle celebrated International Women's Day by almost copying a maternity outfit worn by the Duchess of Cambridge during her pregnancy with Prince George. The 185 pounds Azura swirl printed shift dress was a mid thigh, black and white dress paired with a tailored black jacket. The dress was very similar to what Kate wore back in 2013 when she was pregnant with her first child for the inauguration of the new Warner Brothers Studios. According to Cosmopolitan, Although Meghan is her own stylist she often asks her sister-in-law Kate for advice on fashion on a regular basis. A source said, Meghan has certainly turned to Kate for guidance and inspiration. Meghan is conscious of making her work wardrobe become too trend-conscious. Meghan is still new to this and aware everyone still watches her and wants to be respectful and doesn't want her style to take away from the very important work she's doing. On Friday, Meghan joined leading feminists and national figures for the International Women's Day event at King's College London. The panel included the likes of singer Annie Lennox and former Prime Minister of Australia Julia Gillard. During the event, the trio debated a range of issues affecting women. At the beginning of the event, the chairwoman Anne Silvoy asked Meghan how the bump was treating her. Meghan replied very well and revealed she had been watching a documentary about feminism on Netflix and one of the things they said during pregnancy was I feel the embryonic kicking of feminism. She said, I loved that, boy or girl, whatever it is, we hope that's the case. Her appearance comes just hours after the Duchess was handed a new role as Vice President of the Trust, joining Prince Harry who is President. During the event she also revealed she does not check Twitter but told the Women's Day panel what her favorite newspaper was. She said, but I do read The Economist.